A popular question that we get asked here quite a bit is where can I go to get build advice and tips and tricks for derby vehicles that I've never ran before or I'm brand new to the sport where do I even start well I'm gonna be listing a few sources that I would suggest you check out right after this Hey guys, Alex here from All For Him Racing and today I'm going to be answering the question of where would we suggest you go to get build advice, tips and tricks and those sorts of things for the derby vehicles that you are building. First and foremost, I absolutely would suggest YouTube. That is our platform of choice. Here on All For Him Racing we have produced a lot of content that is tips and tricks for demolition derby and if you are starting out building for the first time or you're really not sure on how to do something, I'm going to pop up a little icon here in the upper corner. Check that out. It is the full playlist of demo derby tips that we have made over the years. Some of the content is a little bit older, I will admit, but it is still very much relevant to the sport today. So make sure to check out all those videos for yourselves and never hesitate to message us with questions. And there's a very large pool of content creators that are further giving advice on different vehicles in different parts of the country that will offer advice based on the rules that they are building to and running. So make sure to check out all those channels and if you haven't considered subscribing to our channel please consider doing so. Another great source of information that I turn to a lot for advice on vehicles that I'm building for the first time is WeCrash.com. So if you have never been to that site make sure to check it out. I'll provide links to all these places that I'm talking about in the description below so make sure to check it out for yourself. Those of you that have been around the sport for a while have seen it have some different forms but you are very much familiar of the content of that website the reason that I like we crash is because there are years and years of experience worth of advice and pictures on that website there's a lot of great content that you guys need to check out if you have questions now if you're new to the sport and really don't know where to start make sure to thoroughly search that site there's a great search bar up at the top and you guys can search it you don't even have to be be a member to the page in order to search the content but I would suggest that if you do have questions that need answered or if you want to offer your own tips and advice make sure to join that page now in keeping up with the times we crash has started a Facebook group at the time of this video there's about 35k strong worth of people as part of that group so there's a lot of people asking questions getting a lot of advice sometimes unfortunately a lot of bad advice because anybody can post content there you do have have to make sure to look in multiple sources and multiple people's opinions to figure out what makes the most sense for your rules but it is searchable and there's a lot of information and content there and it integrates well with the buying and selling of different derby parts and accessories and derby cars I actually made a whole video collaboration with Mitch of Demolition Missions talking specifically about WeCrash.com and WeCrash Facebook. So I'm going to provide a link up above here to that video so you guys can check that out for yourselves. And we go a lot more in depth with those two sites and give you our opinions of the pros and cons of each one if you would like to know a little bit more information about that for yourself. Another great place to look is walk up to people that have built a car for the event that you're looking to run and ask them about the car that they built. If you're planning on running a 91 Honda Accord, well you probably should talk to somebody at the event that has built one of those if you see one being ran. Or if you're planning on building a Crown Vic, they've been running those for a number of years and a lot of people have a lot of different opinions on the way to build those. So check them out for yourself. Walk around a vehicle at your local derby and see what somebody else has done and never hesitate to ask the driver that built that car for advice because they may be able to open a whole new world to you of information that you didn't even know anything about prior to that event one thing to keep in mind though is do not crawl around underneath the vehicles be sensitive to the fact that guys have spent many months building these vehicles and they have learned tips and tricks over the year that they might not want to actually share with you and be willing to understand that but it never hurts to ask somebody saying hey I'm really curious how you set up your rear end can I take a look at it or I'm really curious how you bolted down your hood can you show me what you did never hesitate to ask those kind of questions 
A new source of information is coming out on Facebook for Demolition Derby and it is a Facebook group called Demo Derby Database. I've actually been able to work with other YouTubers and business owners around the sport of Demolition Derby and they have really worked hard at putting together this database with literally every vehicle that has been made, it seems like, that you could potentially run in a Demolition Derby. Make sure to follow the link down below, I'll provide a link to it, it's Demo Derby Database again, and it's on Facebook. You do have to join it, it is a private group, but if you are already a member of it, please make sure to invite your friends as well, so that way more people can be part of the discussion and offer tips and tricks and advice on particular vehicles. So the way that it works is there is a section for literally every vehicle. So if you're looking, again, for the 91 Honda Accord, why that one, I don't know, but if you're planning on running a 91 Honda Accord, you can go to the search bar, which in mobile is gonna be right above at the top of the screen, or off to the left side if you're on a PC. You can search 91 Honda Accord and what it will do is you will see the year ranges of that make and model of vehicle. You can click on that image and then there'll be comments down below for everybody offering tips and tricks and advice on those vehicles. And it's an ever-growing community because the more people join, the more tips and tricks are being added and the more advice that you are gonna be able to get. So what that means is if you are building a specific vehicle for dirt and you want to know the weak points, things to watch out for. Maybe you want to see pictures of how that car bent in another derby. Well, you will now be able to do that simply by searching in that group and you will find the exact vehicle that you're looking for. And that is also a very closely monitored group. So if there is something that you are not finding, then you can message any one of the admins and they will hopefully be able to add a link to that content for you if it's not already in the database. And finally, the best place is in your own garage. Try things for yourself. Here at All For Him Racing, we're constantly doing things a little bit different than what everybody else is, so that way you guys can see some other ways of doing things. Maybe we'll figure something out that actually worked really well, or maybe we learned the hard way that something was a terrible idea, but at least now we've been able to offer it to you guys, so that way you can make a judgment for yourself of whether or not that advice is actually helpful. Hopefully this information was helpful to you guys. If it was, make sure to give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you have not already done so. As I mentioned earlier, all the links talked about in this video will be down below in the description, so make sure to check those out for yourself and figure out what might work best for you. Question of the day, where do you guys like to go to get your tips and tricks and advice? You know, who are you talking to? What questions are you asking? Comment down below and let's help the new guys out figure out where they can go to get information. Maybe there's something that I didn't even mention in this that is actually a great resource and I want you guys to comment below and let me know what that might be. So as always, thank you so much for watching this video guys and until the next video, we'll talk to you later.